start of our day of day five here in Iceland. We camped up that road off in the distance, up on the hill. It was crazy windy, but uh, down at the bottom of this hill we have Gorafas, which is beautiful waterfall, small by the ones, small by the standard of the ones that we looked at before, but uh, Gorafas translates to God's waterfall, which um, derives from when Christianity was first introduced into Iceland and uh, all of the uh, ancient heathen god idols were cast into this waterfall and destroyed. How do you know all this? Because I read it. Oh, in the book? Uh, I forget where I read it. Somewhere on the internet. It is true, yeah. We have this beautiful waterfall off to our right and Sarah's taking pictures of a puddle. I think she's doing some trick reflective photography. I think I want to go on that rock over there. Careful! <laughs> here we go. Ooh, it's misty up here. Look at how close you can get to this stuff here. <laughs> Pretty nice. I think out of all the waterfalls we've seen so far, this one is the prettiest. Maybe it's just the light, you know, because it's early in the morning and the sun is still low in the sky, but yeah, it's just really nice. This is our day five breakfast at the waterfall. Um, I've got some sausages and a grilled cheese on our little stove here. Sarah is eating a cracker, cracker with blueberries. And what I have in my hand right here is this bread that's actually baked um, in the ground um, back where we were yesterday at the uh, at the hot springs. And it's this special kind of rye bread, and it's really, really thick and heavy. It's like five pounds. Yeah, this uh, block here was about eight dollars, but it's heavy. And really, I think you could only eat one small piece like this at a time. And um, it's good with butter on it or, or cheese, but it's a really doughy, rich, sort of sweet flavor. Yeah, it's quite nice. Mmm. Yum. So day five on the road here on the way to uh, whitewater rafting and seems that some Icelandic horses have uh, taken over the streets. <laughs> so they don't seem to want to get out of the way. So I thought we'd just uh, film this. It looks like that guy's trying to corral them yeah. with the car. Yeah, I don't know if that's the, um, if that's the farmer or what's going on, but uh, Clearly the horses are taking the right of way on the uh, one-way bridge. Is that person behind you honking? I guess so. 
Yeah, I don't know. Maybe they're honking at the horses. I wonder if this guy is using the vehicle to, uh, to corral them. Yeah. Who knows? Honking at them. I think the person behind me is honking. I don't know. Everybody's honking to get these horses out of the way. <laughs> this is hilarious. Yeah. Come on, horsies. I bet the, Get I bet going. The guy's corralling them. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, oh, doesn't really look, look like, like it. Look out. Come on, horsies. Let's go. There's babies. Uh, and they're pooping all over the place, too. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, horsies. Where are you going? Well, this is the path of least resistance for Yeah. Them, so. This is strange. Well, some people are just going in for the pass. I don't know. I'm pretty entertained by this. They're kind of unpredictable too, huh? <laughs> wow. That must be a local. Yeah, that must be a local. Yeah, they're just, uh, they, get the little they just don't people. care. Well, now that the uh, horses have moved over, hey, <laughs> what are you guys doing? Seriously. Anyway, so we figured out that there's a woman in that blue SUV and those must be her horses because she's actually been on their tail and crawling them down the road for a few kilometers. Um, yeah, this is our uh, whitewater rafting place, so we're going to leave those horses now. So we're loaded up in a Land Rover on our way to whitewater rafting. Uh, is it Mike? Yeah. Mike from Kenya. How's it going? He's our guide. And the driver, sorry, your name was? Ludwig. Ludwig from Vietnam. <laughs> and then back here, what was your name? Uh, Michael. Michael. Sexy kayaker. Sexy oh, kayaker. Yeah. He's our uh, kayak rescue and chase boat. <laughs> so yeah, getting ready for our whitewater adventure coming soon.
that was fun. So this is how they pull the raft out of the canyon is with an old international tractor on a ramp. Up she goes. Hey, so to finish off an awesome day of whitewater rafting, we stopped at the office of uh, Arctic Adventures. Arctic Adventures? No. Viking rafting. Viking rafting. And uh, yeah, they've got a little bar, so we're enjoying some Gettinger local beer. And Sarah's having a gin and soda, gin and soda sharing it with our travel companion. So, yeah. And, uh, <laughs> yeah. Hi, hi. Big thanks to uh, Mike and Mike. Michael, yeah. Michael and Mike, the Mikes. The Mikes. Yeah, for uh, for the awesome day. So, yeah. Cheers. 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 Cheers.